Okay, so these two hives are pretty interesting. Do you want to tell me about this one? Now, this one was found just laying in the mulch at Holland Park. And rather fortunately, uh, came into my possession with a bit of a, a swap deal. Mm -hmm. I, I believe an, uh, a, a box used to explain stingless bees, the high probability it belonged to Harold Hawkins, or if not, him, someone of his uh, era. Certainly, the the con everything about the construction dates back to the 1900s. Mm -hmm. It's quite advanced, isn't it? Having glass panels. Well, to ha to have a double glass panel uh, in something that is so old, we, we certainly know it is 1965 and earlier, because mm -hmm. it was old at that time. Certainly someone who loved their bees. Uh, and it was, more than that, it was a, an observation box. It, this is a chain which held a stopper, was fitted into the entrance. It was something that someone took with them to show bees off. It wasn't just a, uh, a box in the backyard. Wow. And it, it Hawking's eye again. Yep. And they're Pretty doing very well. It does have a few other... Features. He's a bit of a bit of a architect, this guy. Uh, uh, we, we've got moving shutters on the windows, and round the back we've got the old stove recess. <laughs> but the metal has rusted away, the way they used to. And but the bees made up for it with batchman, which what? is neat. And what's uh, this one? And then we come to a more well, I don't know if it's more recent or not, but. This rather unique one, which is Carbonaria, was holding up progress de 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 down towards Bean Lee. Uh, an industrial site being cleared, and this one little patch of trees stopped the works. And this colony of bees, they couldn't, they weren't clear it until the bees were moved. Wow. Uh, the fauna spotter had contacted me, so we we took the termites out. Uh, I literally mean that, because uh, the termites came back in it, but the termites are harder to feed than the bees. And how did you get the termites out? The bees, termites actually died in it. Yeah, uh, right. They, they survived for like six months, mm -hmm. but I couldn't work out what species. Uh, and uh, you have to get a soldier to identify. We've got plenty of workers, yep. but they kept trying to get to the house. Yeah, right. Uh, but the soldiers just didn't seem to present, so I couldn't identify to know what food. They didn't like pine. I tried pine. They didn't like. They didn't eat pine. Yeah, right. So it was something else they were looking for. So eventually they starved out. So now I've just got the bees. They presumably have gone into a hole that the, was dug by a a bird to nest. Uh, the, the mound itself, intriguingly, once I've got my fingers under the edge, just peeled off. Wow. So, one of the more unusual ones. There you go.